The latest victim of the Grenfell Tower Inferno has been identified as generous, caring, loving mother. Berkti Hoftum, who was 29, has been confirmed by police to be one of the victims of the tragedy, her 12-year-old son Birik is still missing. Ms. Hoftum, who lived on the 18th floor, was one of at least 80 people to die when the West London Tower block burned down on June 14. In a statement, her family said, Berkti was a generous, caring, loving mother, partner, sister, auntie and friend and she will be missed by us all forever. Berkti Hoftum Wright, who was 29, has been identified as the latest victim of the Grenfell Tower Inferno she is pictured with her son Brikett. Ms. Hoftum and her son Brikett are thought to have helped missing 12-year-old Jessica Urbano Wright, phone her mother as the fire raged around them. Ms. Hoftum and her son Brikett are thought to have helped missing 12-year-old Jessica Urbano phone her mother as the fire raged around them. A message posted on Facebook read, Brikett kindly let Jessie call her mum Adriana Ramirez whilst they tried to get down the stairs at 1.29 am and then again at 1.39 am. We believe they were all together whilst trying to evacuate Grenfell. Little Jessica screamed down the phone, Mummy, come and get me in a desperate final phone call. But the 12-year-old has not been heard from since fire raged through the block she called home on June 14. She is presumed to have died. It comes after police confirmed that a total of 255 people are believed to have escaped the inferno. A consultation period on the probe's terms of reference will be extended by two weeks until July 28, a spokesman for the inquiry confirmed. A consultation period on the probe's terms of reference will be extended by two weeks until July 28, a spokesman for the inquiry confirmed. It comes after police confirmed that a total of 255 people are believed to have escaped the inferno. It has been announced that survivors of the blaze are to be given more time to make their case about which issues the forthcoming public inquiry should consider. A consultation period on the probe's terms of reference will be extended by two weeks until July 28, a spokesman for the inquiry confirmed. It had previously been hoped the scope of the investigation would be determined before the parliamentary recess on July 20. Those touched by the tragedy have expressed concern that the inquiry, led by retired Judge Sir Martin Morbick, would not be broad enough. A consultation period on the probe's terms of reference will be extended by two weeks until July 28, a spokesman for the inquiry confirmed. An inquiry spokesman said, since the announcement of Sir Martin Morbick as chair of the Grenfell Tower Public Inquiry, he and his team have held discussions with many interested parties, in particular survivors of the fire and other residents of the Lancaster West Estate. It has become clear from these that there is a broad consensus that those affected need more than the one week originally envisaged for the inquiry's consultation on its terms of reference. We are therefore extending the consultation period until July 28 an extension of two weeks. We believe this strikes the right balance between providing enough time for people to respond meaningfully and ensuring the inquiry's work, which cannot begin without terms of reference, can progress quickly.